All right. So, what is? Protego. Hmm. Let's see the quests that we have. The trials of Merlin. Help the stranger. Sure. This looks like we can get a new spell. So why don't we go and do that? Successfully avoid attack by rule. Oh. Cast Incendio on enemies. Alright, so I know the best place to do this. We need... World map. Let's go back here. Somewhere here we can find more What's enemies. Now? Looking for creatures. So I need to successfully avoid enemy attacks by dodge rolling. This way. Think. What the hell? I've no idea who it is you think I might have seen. I've been busy with my research. I do not have time to. Victor Rookwood don't give a doxy's nip back your time. What the hell? Oi, speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. A student, you can't be <laughs> Enough out of you. Leave her alone. Oh, you're fucked now. This is a fast way to get Get wrecked, nerds. What the hell's this? Oh, what's the light go out of your eyes? Oh shit! The Red Ranger. Stop right there! I'm not going anywhere. Incendio. Okay, are we done? Are we done? What on earth just happened? I've never been accosted in such a manner. Then so close to Hogwarts. So who the hell are those guys? Are you all right? I am, thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills. I'm Can still you rusty. Can tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Can you Victor explain to me what an Ashwander is? Extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story, but thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, Ash you've wanders. avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. You're a researcher? Nora Treadwell at your service. Historian and archaeologist specializing in Merlin's work and life. Merlin's work. I thought that Merlin and the tales about King Arthur's court were a myth. Mere myth? <laughs> You're lucky Sir Cadogan didn't hear you. Chatters on endlessly about his connection to Merlin from his portrait at Hogwarts. Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, and I'm Did studying he? some curious fixtures he left here centuries ago. Fixtures? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them all around the area. Oh, God. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was terribly fond of puzzles and enigmas. Oh, so Merlin was a Slytherin too. Ah. 
I can see why you're so interested in Merlin. I'd be keen to know more about the trials. Well then, I'll let you in on a little secret. Oh God. No one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial clue. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting the trials to work. Mallow Sweet? Versatile herb. Merlin repeatedly mentioned it in his writings. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. You see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has its symbol in the center. That started me thinking, what if... The Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the center of the symbols. Precisely. Okay. Would you care to do the honors? We can see what comes of our little hypothesis. Sure. I brought a trunk chock full of Mallow Suite with me. It's just over there by my tent. This trunk? Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. I don't know I if have I have Mano Sweet. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as well as a stone swell on the ground. Each trial has these features. Place the Mallow Sweet on the swirl, and we'll see what happens. Which swirl? Okay, what are you talking about, lady? Mm. Oh, this, okay. What should I do now? Light them. Hmm, this is uncharted. Incendium. Beard. The flames make the pyre sink. What does that do? Hell. What a day. I can hardly believe it. Okay, so what did that do? I take it we can call that a success? We can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swirl on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need to continue my research. My guess sure. is that each will also require Mallow Suite, which you can find in Hogsmeade should you need more. I really must be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. Sure thing. And do be careful out here. Now, I've got what I needed. I shall return to the safety of my notes and books. Yes. Complete Merlin Trials to get different gear. Sure. But I wanted to get... This one. Greetings, young Slytherin. Scrope knows about the old book you found for Professor Feek. Scrope can help you. And you can help Scrope. Get to the courtyard past the pendulum. If you don't know it, you'll see it easy enough. And don't tell anyone what you're up to. Especially Professor Black. Okay, what the hell? You're gonna keep changing everything? Scrope's last hope. Attend defense against the dark arts class during the day. Okay, we'll actually go for this one.
defense against the dark arts. Okay, we're gonna go here. <sighs> Level three. Final round. Hello, Lucan. Is the final round of Cross Wands ready? Big match today. It all comes down to this. The moment that we find out if your training and dedication is enough to win it all. Ready for a shot at glory? Absolutely. I certainly am. Brilliant. Let's try. Are you dealing with a partner? Yes, Sebastian. Then let's get started. It's probably going to be like... Six on two anyway. We can make this a real victory. That's the spirit. It's four on two. Yeah, breakthrough spells with a corresponding color. I know that. Incendiary. Oh, what the fuck? Sebastian's not pulling his weight. They made a crap's breakfast out of you that round. Good to try again. Yeah, sure. Yes, I'm ready now. Very well. Good luck out there. Oh. God damn, they take so much fucking damage. Oh, poor. Holy shit. Wow, this is ridiculous. Care to try again? Hmm. Yes, I'm ready now. Very Fuck well. sakes. Good luck out there. Let me actually check something. I want to change the fucking targeting in this game because it's retarded. No, I want... Aiming sensitivity. No. Toggle spellcast mode. No. Switch sticks. No. Wait a minute. Well, aiming. Swap the functionality. Oh, no. Left-handed. Can't really change it, so gotta do it anyway. Fuck that spell. Let me 
Fuck off! Wow. Fuck it. I'm done. I am fucking done. Can't try again? No, I don't think so. Not right now. Understandable. But don't take too long. We'll be waiting. I need fucking better spells than this shit. Okay, what the fuck am I looking at? I need better spells. What the fuck is that? Serious note. I'm not doing Scrope? anything for scope. Who is Scrope? I don't give a fuck who Scrope is. Not doing anything for Scrope or Dobby or any of these fucking miscreants. Do I seriously have to put on these glasses just to last a little longer? God damn it. Look goofy as fuck. Whatever. Sure. Whatever. Let's just look like a total fucking knob. Why not? We'll look like a total fucking knob, but at least we'll be able to take more damage. Alright, so we need defense against the dark arts. Which is here. Alright. Wasn't even a class. Didn't even learn anything. What did I learn? I hope you were able to take care of everything I... Professor, I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Disarm. Ooh. Spellcasting sounds... requires a focused mind and a steady wand. A disarm spell. Good mm. work. The dummy is here if you wish to stay in practice. Assign the skills. Put it... There we go. Expelliarmus, you seem to have the right end of the stick. But keep practicing. Expelliarmus may save your life one day. Disarms wands from other, and or other weapons from enemy hands. Different types of enemies will react in different ways. Still at it, I see. Okay. Is that all? Hmm. So that's the new quest. Spell combinations. Oh, I didn't even remember that. Okay, let's go back to the clock tower. Uh, yeah, I need to use the practice dummy. 
Hello, Lucan. I'd like to practice with the training dummy. Excellent idea. This time will be a bit more of a challenge. Ready? Well, that'd be brilliant. Wonderful. I'll set things up. Remember to cast all the spell combinations before the dummy lands again. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. Okay. Go. Oh no, okay. So there's no strikes between. Keep trying. Excuse me? Excellent fall. What's the next one? Oh, no. Shit. Oh. Fuck! Asshole! Alright. One, two, three. One, two, three. Incendium. One, two, three, four. Good one. Impressive wand work. I'd hate to face you in a duel. It was only a training dummy. True, but it's a difficult dummy. Believe me, I know. Seriously, well done. Training dummies will think twice before challenging you again. Plus, you'll be even more formidable in crossed ones. Other jewelers had better beware. If I could remember that that combo. I'd pull it off in the right situation. I could turn these opponents into dog food. But that's probably not gonna happen for a while. I still need to practice that. Find the missing pages. Yeah, I'm not worried about that. Search for the next note. Revelio. The Well of Four Beasts. Sure. Random owl. Accio. Incendio. Levioso. Expelliarmus. Hmm. Revelio. There we go. Almost there. Head for the pumpkins just down from the circle, from the stone circle. Look inside one of them. Pumpkins? Ah, I think I know just the place. Do you? Because I have no idea where pumpkins grow around here. Oh, wait, this place. Look inside one of the pumpkins, huh? Knock it off. Revelio. The young Slytherin must be exceptionally curious by now. 
Meet Scrope at the water's edge by the broken docks. Down to the water's edge? Hmm, this had better not be a trick. Yeah, I know. Some gold. Some potion. By the broken docks. Okay, so he's somewhere down here. What is this? Rebellion. <laughs> Thank you for coming all this way. What do you want? The name's Scrope. Scrope serves the headmaster. Been in the Black family for years. Apologies for the abundance of notes. Scrope wanted to be sure you weren't followed. What's what happened this all to you about? here? Your notes mentioned the book I found in the restricted section. Scrope can tell you more in exchange for your help, but no one, especially the headmaster, can know. Okay. Happy to help, especially if you can shed light on the book. Scrope is grateful. Scrope's late mistress, Apollonia Black, may she rest in peace, was a student at Hogwarts uh, over 50 years ago. Before she died, she spoke with passion of pages ripped from a book. Scrope suspects she took them to her private grotto. She was delirious at the end, poor thing. Mistook Belladonna for elderberries. <laughs> Scrope tried to warn her. I'm sorry to hear that. But... How do you benefit if I find the pages? Scrope believes that a treasured Black family ring is also in the grotto. Scrope wishes to give it to the headmaster. Apollonia forbade Scrope from entering the grotto long ago. Scrope continues to honour her wishes. Scrope would not dare ask a student for help. But when Scrope learned you were looking for those pages, Scrope thought you might also find the ring. God damn it. I'll go. It seems this may help us both. Um, I shall do it. Scrope is relieved. Scrope hoped the young Slytherin would be willing to help. Take this toast to the grotto just down the coast. And place it on the pedestal there. Good luck. Scrope will wait right here for you. Yeah. Best of luck finding your pages. And the ring. And the ring, yes. It's her secret grotto. Revelio. What is that? It's a... It's a creature! Okay. Wow. Asshole. Shit, there's a bunch of them. Holy shit, dude. That doesn't work. Oh, you fucking...
Jesus Christ. These things are no joke. No joke at all. Wow, dude, you can't swim for shit either. Oh, okay. Why would I need a piece of toast? I suppose that's where it goes. Piece of toast? I don't necessarily think that squids eat toast, but okay. I will collect this. Could it be a visitor? Ooh. Oh. Ah. Ooh. <laughs> ah. And who are you? The name's Richard Jackdaw. I was a student just like you about a century ago. How in the world did you find this place? A house elf named Scrope sent me. Said I might find a black family ring here. Ah. Sorry to say, I sold the ring a long time ago. Poor Scrope. Still holds a candle for Apollonia, I reckon. Can't say I blame him. I stole all these treasures just to impress her. Alas, t'was to no avail. I thought a secret map I pilfered from Peeves would pique her interest. But she simply rolled her eyes. What would I want with yellowed old pages torn from a book? Not my finest moment. Hmm... I'd like to have those pages, if you don't mind. They're not here. I God damn thought it. if Apollonia wasn't interested in the map on the pages, perhaps it would lead to something that would intrigue her. So, I followed the map to what I can only describe as an enchanted cave of some kind. And mm. you see what happened next. Here's an idea. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest, and I'll what? show you where to find the pages. Okay. I suppose if that's the only way for me to get those pages, I'll meet you at the forest. I'm sure the pages are still tucked in my waistcoat. If you don't mind the sight of a, well, my decapitated skeleton, they're yours for the taking. Oh. Uh, nice. We're gonna go looking for a dead body. Ah, huh. interesting. That looks like Hogsmeade. The Dark Forest. Hmm, a map. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. Okay. Revelio. We gotta go tell Scrope that the pages weren't even there. No pages, no ring. <laughs> Skill! Oh, damn it! Stupid frog. Freaking battle toad. Dick. Okay. <laughs> the water's like ankle high, so 
shouldn't take that much effort to get out of the water. Scrope, you dingbat. Hello, Scrope. Thanks to you, I was able to enter Apollonia's grotto. The toast was the key. I met a ghost there, Richard Jackdaw, who's agreed to lead me to the pages I've been looking for. Oh, that boy was never good enough for Apollonia. Oh, what of the Black Family Ring? I'm sorry to say that Jackdaw sold it long ago. Sad news indeed. Scrope shall need to think of another way to impress the headmaster. Well, Scrope takes some consolation in knowing that the young Slytherin found what they needed. I did. Thank you again, Scrope. You're a credit to house elves. Sure. A credit to house elves. Oh, what's this? <gasps> okay, so here we have a square. And here we have... Okay, maybe we just uh, get this. Okay, that seems correct. And it's now hit it with fire. Oh, he's good. This could ah, be dangerous good. if I'm not careful. Hmm. Rebellio. What is down here? Navigator scarf. That it? Hmm. It looks Rebellion. like looks like this opens. Maybe. Or maybe it doesn't. Maybe that's all that was down here. Wait, let me take a look at that symbol again. Cuz obviously it's going to open with some kind of spell. But I don't think it's a spell that I have. Nothing that I have looks like that. So that's not going to work. It's either I need to find some kind of item to progress into that deeper, or I've already gotten as far into it as I can. All the way... Forbidden Forest. Wait a minute. What in the fuck is that sound? Something's coming. Oh, Jesus. Gross. Take a leech. Yeah, let's try not to antagonize too many of them. More wig and worm potions. It's a good thing to have.
Here I am, as good as my word. What's good? We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. It took the cunning of a Slytherin to track down these pages. Well said. Now where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Oh no. Keep your eyes open for a birdbath. When you find it, say birdbath. intramuros. I think it's Latin. Or Greek. As you can imagine, I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? Infraneuros? I'm pretty sure that's Latin. Aside from the birdbath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks. A stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a lake. You'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately Rebellion. coming back to me. Lots of spiders here. Hmm. Yes. You know, the closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Probably best I leave you to it. Simply okay. stick to the path and keep a sharp eye out for that bird bath. Adieu. Is that one? Nothing to do now but keep going. Revelio. Um, the waterfall. For a thief, Jackdaw's surprisingly as good as his word. Okay, it's, it's gonna keep showing me the path, so just stick on to the path. The fuck is this? What the hell? Okay, well... Centaurs, you guys okay? Revelio. Something oddly solemn about this place. Such regal creatures, stags. The leak. The lake. Here's the bird bath. There it is. Just as Jackdaw described. Intramuros. Intramuros. Revelio. Aren't you a little far from home? Oh Man, shit. I knew you'd eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. You're <laughs> <laughs> not very good at this, are you? Now, let's see where that door has led me. Jack's, oh, Jack Dawes' tomb.